Hello, I'm Sarah Scott. Um, so, new video um, because it was my stroke anniversary uh, last week. Um, so, um, I had my stroke um, six years ago, which is a long time and it seems like yesterday. Um, but yeah, so I'm um, my age now is twen twenty four, um, and I'm still working at the school. Um, my job is um, um, science technician. Um, it's not full time but it's a job that I love and I really, um, it's uh, an, a good, fun job, um, it's just things that um, I can do, um, it's very, um, what's the word, practical stuff, so even though I need to talk, um, it's more things that I can do um, after my stroke, so that's good. Um, so, um, and we're still doing um, our stroke group, um, and that um, it's good that it's still going. Um, but there's things that I want to do, um, some goals that I want to do as maybe still working at the school but maybe doing another job as well and we were I was thinking about doing a um a um jewellery um making jewellery jewellery um at home and then selling it uh online or maybe actually face to face as well, I'm not sure um, what we want to do yet um, because you can do classes and things like that so I think I'm going to do that and um, see but that's kind of exciting um, because what I want to do is to have a house on my own um, and be independently what I would do if I didn't have my stroke and I think I can do that anyway it doesn't matter I, I had a stroke it, um, I, I think I can do it um, and what sort of um, issues do you think you would have if you lived on your own because you still have there's issues still that I numbers is still difficult it's definitely better and if I do some um, exercises but like uh, um, trying to do some numbers all the time that helps me but things like reading and writing is still difficult so if there's you know something there's a letter that I need to read if I'm on my own it's going to be hard um, Online, I've got some apps that help me, but it's still difficult. So it, um, that's a thing that I. It's going to be. But you can probably find ways of working around it, can't you, and get support and and stuff like that. So. Yeah, it's not yeah. like I can't do it. It's just going to be harder than you know another person that is not. It's not difficult to rewrite mm -hmm. like me. So that's just yeah. So when you had your stroke, did you think it would take six years to get this far? It's really like slow recovery from aphasia for most people, isn't it? Um. Obviously, I didn't know anything about stroke and aphasia, and I'm kind of glad that I didn't know because I would be really. Uh, upset and depressed really because it's a hard thing to be 
because your mind is the same, but obviously you have problems with talking. So, so I was actually we were saying about um, there was a lady that had a brain hemorrhage and um, and she is very very bright but her speech is affected and she said that if you can speak very well it's kind of powering because you can say whatever you want to say and the other person will think oh my god you, you're really intelligent and very but if your speech is affected people think you're not very bright or you're drinking or you're smoking or not, not drinking, <laughs> um, um, drugs no, drugs and um, yeah, yeah drugs and that's not true but it I know what what she's saying because that's very true and yeah, yeah. so when you didn't have much speech output did you could you still hear or did you still know the sentences in your mind that you wanted to say or you couldn't express them it's kind what, of like in your like? in your brain you your words are the same before your stroke so you're and the same with if you're sleeping and you've um like a dream so your speech is the same but then it's in between your um your mouth and your um, brain and there's something in between that doesn't yeah. <laughs> and it's and you think well you understand me but your because your speech is not perfect that a lot of people don't understand or that they're not hearing what you're saying and it's very hard because it, in your head you're you know what to say and you're very maybe very bright yeah but so so um, what if somebody's watching this and somebody that they love has just had a stroke or has aphasia how, what how do you think they should talk to them do you think they should give them extra time and um it's difficult because every stroke or a brain attack um has Every person is so different. So for me, um, if there was people that are talking to me, I can't kind of understand almost everything. But some people are, it's difficult to, if the people are talking to us, uh, uh, the people that have um, strokes or whatever, they have a hard, like, so you need to slow down really mm -hmm. so it depends um so obviously you just need to talk to the person just say what it is it difficult to understand what i'm saying or if it's too fast or sometimes it's too slow and you think you know i'm not stupid <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just I mean, yeah so yeah and and um, maybe they, people say about sticking to one topic, is that helpful? Um, it depends. You, you need to just talk to the person. Ask them. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and if you've got a piece of paper and a pen, and sometimes it's not actually the person that needs help, it's the other. So it's mm. just like, you know, it's if it's difficult, just... Um, and obviously if there's lots of people that's the hard thing mm. like still I feel um, that if there's noise it's hard or if it's actually not people just music or it, it's Background things like noise. that mm. um, but I think yeah and I think that doing a video is I think an important thing because you think whatever you have a problem so maybe your speech is good but reading writing is difficult or whatever that you think 
that's it. There's nothing. You're just going to be the same Stuck forever. Mm. But that's not true. And it's not just one, uh, one um, year. It's more than that. You can do it if you want to do it. So do videos if you want to do it, because every year you'll see pro, 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 I can't say pro progress, yeah. and you can do it, but you need just to do some exercises, even though it's really hard. Do you think that some people's stroke is so severe that maybe they won't. I mean, we've met very few people that have made no progress. It doesn't moment. matter if you had a stroke and it's very mild or it's really big because my uh, uh, stroke was very... And it doesn't matter about if you're young or not. Just, it's still hard, whatever, if you're yeah. young or old as well. Like, so it doesn't matter if you're old or old or whatever. Just do exercises, and if you're tired, sleep. Like there's lots of, and also just do different things every day. Don't do just the the the, the same things because that's not very good. Because but new experiences and getting out is difficult, isn't it? But it's much better to get out and talk to people if you can try and mix with people because you can feel very isolated can't you and if there's a group um go see if you like it if you don't like it i'm sure there's another group mm -hmm. um if there's not we can t well talk to us because we have a group because we set up we it. do so it's not and also difficult. there's a really good group online aphasia recovery connection arc they're on Facebook, aren't they? And they're really yeah. good for people with aphasia all over the world. Yeah. So there's so. a lot. So just contact you, um, us, if you have yeah. any problems, because um, it, I think it's a a really good thing because you feel like you're isolated and you think it's just you, but mm -hmm. it's not. That's lots of people who have very similar problems, and um, yeah, you can do it. And you've been on a, a journey, haven't you? But not a one you would have chosen. A different <laughs> path, but I'm still happy. So that's the important thing. Yeah. And I think in your first video you said don't give up. And, that's and I important. think the same thing now. Yeah, so. yeah. yeah. Is there anything else you want to say? And be positive all the time because that's. Uh, yeah, it's it, not always easy, is it? But Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. It's a weird, um, a weird thing. But um, yeah. Yeah. But you're still here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye.